Hello, good morning, everyone. Good morning, mamas. Woo! I just want to be here with you this morning, day five of the Listen to Your Heart in Parenting Challenge. I just have to say, my kids um, got sent home yesterday from a winter storm, and now there's a e-learning day. And um, also got word that Tuesday is a day off as well. And we already had Monday off for for Parent President's Day. So they're having five days of no school. And a lot of feelings are coming up for me that I have to deal with, to sit with. So real life, listening to the heart in parenting going on here in my life. This is why I do the work that I do to support all of you. It's an ongoing journey. Once you are a mom, you are always a mom, and it is time to get down into the heart of your own parenting. So that's what I'm doing with this challenge. If you are just finding this video for the first time, there are five videos on my YouTube channel. You can search Tanya Milano Parent Coach. You can find all of them there. The posts are in my Facebook group. So you go over to Facebook, search Reactive to Relaxed, Self-Care Without the Guilt. Um, it's also on my personal Facebook page. There is a link to my group there. Um, in the group, no matter when you find this challenge, it will always be in the guide section of that group. So you can go to the guides, uh, look for this challenge. There's all the posts, all the videos there. You can do it anytime. It is a deep dive into what shaped your parenting. Today, I'm going to talk about vulnerability and um, and the parts uh, that go into discovering your own vulnerability, your own heart, and your parenting. So, all the links are in the description of this video. If you want to find things, um, I was inspired by this book, Atlas of the Heart. And also my parent coaching, Pure Joy Parent Coaching. This is the work that I do. We go through our um, the parts that I'm going to talk about today. Vulnerab vulnerability. Um, Brene Brown's quote in this book I wanted to show to share first. Vulnerability is not weakness. It's our greatest measure of courage. Vulnerability is not weakness. It's our greatest measure of courage. And I have a child that's crying, so we'll see what happened. They're coming. <sighs> triggers. My triggers are showing up here. Live video. Okay. So she talks about the four parts of um, making meaning in your in your um, vulnerability, in your emotional. Uh, landscape, if you will. The four parts are, this is what I go through in my coaching. I have an eight-week program where we go through each part um, of your trigger. Um, so I can do this one-on-one -on -one if you want to book a chat with me. We can talk about it. I also have groups where we come together in about eight to ten people and we go through the material as a group. So depending on your, your level of comfort um, do you like one-on-one -on -one or do you like to be in a group discussion? I have two options. So this is what we go through. She explains in the book that there is the biology. So that's the body, what's coming up in the body. Biography, which is where you came from, your story, your family life, your history, right? Your behaviors. So your emotional landscape whatever behaviors are coming up. And the last one is your backstory. So this is um, backstories like what is going on in the moment? What are the stories you have that are playing out in your parenting? Okay, so I wrote down a few things. Like think, um, think about when your child is having a behavior. Let's say you are out actually out in public 
and they're having a behavior that you disagree with, okay? But what stories do you start to tell yourself? First, about them. Maybe they are being disrespectful. Um, they're embarrassing, whatever it is. And then you turn back into yourself. What belief systems are you having? That all kids should behave, maybe one of them, that you respect people um, in your environment. Uh, you know, what are the beliefs going on? And then going back down into your vulnerability. This is where the courage comes. What do you say about yourself then when all that's happening? Like, um, I'm not a good parent. I should be able to control my kids. I should know what to do. Um, maybe it's, I don't matter. My kids don't care about my feelings, right? If they're not listening to you or um, you're giving them instructions and they're just ignoring you. So maybe it's, I don't matter. Um, I'm not good enough. I don't have it together. All these stories that come up. This is where we're going and to the heart of our parenting. When we can recognize all this that's going under the surface, that's when we can really show up with the courage that we need. Um, the other thing that Brene Brown says in here, chapter two, and we're having a book club if you want to join the next two Sundays. Um, there's a link in the description of this video as well. Register for the, the, um, the workbook. And then you'll get the Zoom links or just message me if you want to come. There's sun, next two Sundays, 4 p.m. Eastern. We'll talk for about an hour on this book. Um, you don't even really have to read the book if you don't have it, but we're talking about all these things. So her second chapter starts with comparison. So this may be coming up for you in your parenting. Comparison. It is the crush of conformity from one side and competition from the other. It's trying to simultaneously fit in and stand out. Okay. So you may be developing your own strategies in parenting that are different from your parents. So you're, you're simultaneously trying to stand out, try to forge your own path. But then there's still this comparison, like, am I doing it right? This is so different. Um, and, and conformity, when you see it in social media, like, they're doing it that way. What's wrong with me? You know, what does it say about yourself? Another thing she says about comparison is it's not actually an emotion. It drives all sorts of big feelings that can affect our relationships and our self-worth. So this is where we need to build our self-worth in our parenting. We are all, our kids need us to develop our own self-worth and to show up empowered in our parenting. So make sure that you are taking advantage of all the stuff I have in the guide section of my Facebook book, Facebook page, the group. It is all free in there. If you are ready to dive deeper into this work with me, you have got to message me. Let me put this up on the screen. Um, Ohm in the Home Revolution is my membership program. So this is where I show up weekly to talk with parents. And I have tons of coursework that you can work through to really dive deep into your stories that you're telling yourself. What kind of new paths do you want to make? How do you stop comparing yourself to other parents and other families and create the unique structure and culture that you want in your own family? It is like 10 years of content that I put into this program, you know, strip off 10 years of struggle um, of now I understand what I want for my family, what I want for myself and how to meet the needs of all four of us. Um, so message me if you wanna have a chat. 
We, you can decide if you're in or out. The price will be going up this year. Um, right now it's at founding member price. It's like 90% off. I'm including all kinds of stuff for you. Um, yoga, the yoga app, reclaim your body, transform your mind. And um, the first five people get into my April group of parenting pause. And this is where we go through the eight weeks of our working with our trigger, getting to the biology, the backstory, the um, biography, and the, what's the other one? Behavior, your emotions that are coming up. So I'm excited. Book a chat with me if you want to talk about these things face to face. We can talk about them. We can see if it's a right fit for you. The just the my calendar is on the dis, in the description of this video, so you could book a free chat with me, and uh, we can go from there. Um. Yeah. So. Uh, make sure you do the um, daily post because I'll be picking a prize winner later today or tomorrow. Um, and yeah, uh, let me know how you how this challenge went for you. I really, really want to hear it. Um, and and take some screenshots of your take some pictures of your workbook or just share some of the things that came up for you. Um, this is how I learn how, what programs to make for you and um, where we go from there in our in our Facebook community. Thanks again and I will see you next week. Bye for now.